You know, I think it's time for me to look for a new job. I've been at my current job way too long. I am bored AF. Dude, you've only been there for three months. I've been there that long? I'm not really qualified for most of the jobs I apply for. I'm just good at acting as though I'm qualified. If my resume were honest, I'd list bullshit as my top skill. This entry-level job says you need to have five to six years of experience in the industry or they're not gonna hire you. It's like, what? This is like the girls who won't date me because I haven't had a girlfriend before. Like, ladies, one of you is gonna have to step up and take a chance on your boy. I would just like to find a job where I can leave work at work. Cause with my current job, man, it's like I, I get home and I'm worrying about, did the customers get what they needed? Did I carry out my duties correctly? Did I remember to say, my pleasure? Who knew Chick-fil-A was such a tough gig? I just need a job so I can pay the bills while I do what I'm passionate about on the side. And what I'm passionate about is spending money. So you can see my problem here. It's important to engage in self-care during the job hunt because you're gonna face a lot of dead ends and rejection. Unfortunately, I'm gonna need to buy all new work clothes because my self-care routine consists of eating whole sleeves of Girl Scout cookies. Yeah. It's a big waste of time to apply for jobs online. The only way to get a job is to know somebody who can get you a job. And I don't know anybody. So it looks like I'm staying unemployed. You need to make a human connection with your job application, okay? So figure out who's the hiring manager at that company and then address your cover letter specifically to them. Do a little research, figure out what are their hobbies? Where do they live? What are their children's names? Casually mention all that during the job interview. These job listings are terribly written. Unclear syntax, improper punctuation. You know what you never see on here? Job listings for people who write job listings. I smell a conspiracy. All these jobs say you need to be able to work in a fast paced environment. But where are all the jobs that say you need to work in a slow paced environment? Oh, that's right. To find those, I'd need to search for government jobs. I developed my own software to find high paying jobs, then send off resumes using keywords from the postings. Today, I've got an interview to be the provost at a major university. What does a provost even do? No clue. But I'm sure I can develop software to do the job for me. At my last job, I filed paperwork into a filing cabinet. So on my resume, I put, I oversaw organization of essential data for ease of access and speedy retrieval. Hopefully that will confuse someone enough to think I did something important. I'm looking to make a career shift. I think you'll find there are many transferable skills from my previous job as a zookeeper to this position as an FBI agent. Time to brush up my resume, or in other words, time to take the very little that I've accomplished during my professional career and make it seem as though I should have won the Nobel Prize, all the while falling further and further into despair as I realize how pathetic I appear on paper. Hooray! Hello there, Mr. Musk, mind if I call you Elon? I wanna be your next Tesla salesman, and I was just calling to make the connection, let you know I'm here, and I am ready to work for you. <laughs> How did I get your number? Um, LinkedIn Premium. That's probably where I saw it. Oh, hey, they emailed me. Dear sir, thank you for applying for the open position, however, we have decided to go with another candidate. It's okay, you, you can't take it personally. I mean, never mind that our society equates your job and how much money you make with your inherent value. You just can't let it get to you. It's not a reflection of me as a human being. Not at all. You. Yo, check out these cool designs you could be wearing on your own body. Tap the icon on the screen or go to the link in the description. You could be drinking out of cups and repping your favorite YouTube channel, which is this one. Till next time, stay cool and attractive.